Get him with the ice, slow him down a little bit. And now one more hit and this guy's a goner. And we leveled up. Thank goodness, talent points available. All right, what did he have? We got new boots, plus three armor. Hey guys and gals, Polly Jr. here. Welcome to Wild West and Wizards by Lava Boot Studios. I will put a link down below in the description so you can check it out for yourself. That'll lead to the Steam store page. It is an early access game and it is launched. It was launched today, August 29th, 2019. It should be available at the time of this recording. Oh, that, that, I've been spotted. Ow. Oh, gosh. Okay. I just got hit with something cold. Let's hide. I don't think these bushes are going to provide very good cover. <laughs> All right. Heal up. Drink a potion. So, yeah, this is uh, just came out on Steam. And I got a code from the developer, Lava Boot Studios. And it's an open world, a low poly open world exploration game, uh, RPG shootery thing. And uh, it combines the Wild West with fantasy wizards and spells and stuff. So, yeah, guns and spells, what could possibly go wrong, right? So, I'm gonna blast this guy with some fire. Think about that, pal. And how about some ice? It will freeze him, we'll burn him, and then we'll shoot him. Okay, this rifle is only a single shot bolt action or some type. There we go. Get wrecked full. Dang, outlaws are everywhere. What do they have? Shell casings, mana potions, and uncommon revolver bullets. All right, great. Well, we have a revolver too. So, in fact, I have three different guns. I bought two guns. I bought this repeater and the rifle that we just used. And this repeater is pretty sweet too. It's like a uh, lever action or something. Holds a lot of bullets and it shoots fast. But it doesn't really do a whole heck of a lot of damage. Let's see what the wizard had. The wizard had some bullets, which is nice. All right. More loot here in the crates and the barrels. I'm just going to go through it all and grab it. I think most of that stuff is for crafting or selling. Let me just show you what we have here. This is my equipment so far. This is Paulina Punchwood, by the way. I did find these nice boots. They're plus one armor and plus one finesse when you put them on those feet. You get a little bonus over here in your stats. Finesse and armor. Uh, accordingly right so pretty cool there we have abilities we've got a fireball spell that does a bunch of damage up front and then burn over time and an ice shard spell that does cold damage up front and then it slows the target down somewhat and we have a talent tree over here that needs to be uh, unlocked to get to the good stuff obviously and we can upgrade these spells in town uh, edge town down here there's a wizard in town and he can upgrade our abilities as well but uh we got to get up to level two right here so we're, we're gaining experience now here's our inventory the equipment obviously we have a tool belt of ammunition all kinds of ammunition we have healing potions mana and bandages and then over here we have our basic resources which I, again i'm pretty sure these are mostly just for selling and using in crafting recipes but i haven't been unable to craft anything yet I haven't figured that out the orbs of upgrade are used to upgrade uh, weapons and armor and uh, and your abilities at some point. Have not got that far yet though. So let's. Uh, we're on a quest. We're on a quest right now to find these tools of the trade for the blacksmith in town. He's going to give us a free upgrade if we can locate his tools, which are to the southwest of town, stashed away in a cabin somewhere. So this is southwest. Now there's a cave over here. Um, and I did go in the cave, and it was tough. I died because it's a level 2 quest right here. We have to find Freddy Four Fingers. And I, I'm wondering if that's four fingers on one hand or four fingers total. Uh, I don't know. I guess we'll find out when we find them. But there's a bounty system in this game, so you can hunt down bounties and get paid for it in town. But that guy was tough. Holy smokes. We got a fire wizard here. So we're going to use... We are going to use uh, ice on this character. So, yeah, there is a... Oh, yeah, that's a desert outlaw fire wizard. And now we're going to shoot with our repeater. I'm going to lock on. There's a lock on key here. Oh, that burns. Oh, that burns. Uh, we are burning right now, and it hurts. It hurts bad. But uh, hopefully we can make it. This is how I died last time. And burn over time, man. Really, really does a bunch of damage. And I don't know how you can put yourself out. Maybe there's a spell that we can get someday to uh, douse your body. But, yeah, that's a fire wizard, so you want to hit them with the counter spell, which is clearly a uh, ice spell. 
All right, I think, was that guy alone? Oh, there's, that must be the camp. Ooh. Okay, is this the bandit camp and the cabin? That's what we're looking for. But I see a lot of uh, banditos here. Another ice, oh, is ice wizard. Let's sneak up on him. Blast him with some fire. Gotta love that. Oh, gosh. Ooh. Dang it. Now, there is a dodge key, I think. But Oh, there it is. Okay, yep. Hold down shift or hit shift and then a direction and you can dodge. So, hold on a second. Just rubbing my eyes. There's something in it. All right, there we go. I'm blaming my aim on my eye. Ooh, what the heck is this thing? It's smoking. Does that mean there's something good in there? A tier one weapon chest f key fragment. I don't know what that is. Looks like we're going to be able to maybe make uh, keys out of these fragments. Fragment of a weapon chest key. Bring five of these to a blacksmith to craft a key. Yes, we can. Uh, I think I'm going to switch back to my rifle. This is kind of like a sniper rifle. Whoops, no, not that. Oh, we've been spotted. I'm getting shot. Back away. Back away. In a pretty good range, these guys. Oh, there's a wizard down there, too, isn't there? All right, this does nice damage at a distance. But we're getting shot at. It's clearly a fire wizard. That's not the wizard. That's the outlaw. Well, they're all outlaws, I guess, but he's the guy with the gun. <laughs> Ow! Yeah, the wizards have guns, too. Holy cow. Get some cover. Tell you, this game is rough, man. This game is rough. Let's reload. And shoot that wizard. Maybe we can disrupt him. No, it doesn't seem like it. Well, hit him with that, anyway. Good. Got him. I think I'm going to switch back to the repeater, but now it's too late. You can only cycle through two different weapons. I'm going to go back to my revolver. This guy's getting real close. Okay, revolver does good damage. It's just a slow shooter. Hold on. Who's that wizard at? And it was down there. Little stinker. All right, let's go get him. Oh, he's behind me. <laughs> you sneaky. You sneaky devil. Wow. Very good flanking maneuver. All right. So we're burning. Slowly, but I think I think we'll pull through. I think Paulina Punchwood will pull through. There we go. All right, heal up, girl. Now, we can switch to these bandages. And can we heal up? Okay, we cannot heal up any farther with the bandages. Uh, let's go back to the health pots, which are very, um, very common in the game. So, so feel free to use them liberally. All right, we got another bandit here. He's not paying much attention. I don't know. <laughs> uh, hold up. Can I use my... K key with this. No, there is a key you can use to, oh gosh, to lock on, but that's only with the guns, apparently. He's, he's, what's he doing? Oh, he's running over here. That's what he's doing. He, he must have a shotgun. Let's back it up and blast him with some fire. Oh, that burns, doesn't it, pal? Ooh, it sure does. Yeah, if they run at you like that, that usually means they have a shotgun. And he has some shells, too. Cool. Outlaw gang leader. Oh, he's a level two. Okay. This could get hairy, but I think if we blast him, it's not looking. Oh, phew, I missed. <laughs> I mean, it's really hard to aim with that thing, especially when they're moving. <laughs> I mean, it's not hard to aim. It's just hard to hit. I don't know what he's doing. All right, this guy's got some kind of a long-range weapon, apparently, because he's not trying to get close. So we're going to win this battle because he's not a wizard. Burn him. Oh, man, he dodged me. You stinker. Dodge this, pal. There we go. Oh, no, I missed again. All right, we got him down now. We got him now. Get him with the ice. Slow him down a little bit. And now one more hit, and this guy's a goner. And we leveled up. Thank goodness. Talent points available. All right. What did he have? We had new boots. Plus three armor for those boots. Not too shabby. And an orb of upgrade. All right. Now we can go get the tools of the trade. For our blacksmith friend, and we will get paid for that. Just walk around back real quick. Oh, got a grave over here. Oh, something here. Oh, wow. Fine Sandwalker's boots. Plus two armor, plus one agility. Oh, yeah, we'll, we'll, we're going to rob that grave. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Ain't nothing sacred out here. There we go. Beautiful. So now we have plus two armor. And now it's time to go in. Hopefully there's nobody inside. I guess we can save it just in case things go terribly. Oh, maybe we should spend that talent point first. So we have one talent point to spend. 
and unlocking requires three points apparently so we're just gonna upgrade our fire or our ice shard spell i'm wondering if there's like a heat seeking upgrade that would be super nice well i guess i'll just lower the cost of the fire that sounds fine okay let's go inside nobody here oh 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 we got we got a gun it's a repeater oh, i already bought one and it's just a common repeater that's too bad i mean they were cheap enough to buy it was only 100 coins so um i guess that was kind of a waste some health pots here we're looking for the blacksmith's tools oh i got them just said that we, were, we added them really oh there they are blacksmith's tools all right we're gonna go bring those back and give them to the blacksmith and get a free upgrade but hold on we got a book here benedict sent me out here set up camp near edgetown found this nice cabin here and figured it'd be a good spot to take over the owner was a bit more trouble than i reckoned but we took him out nonetheless nevertheless i can't at least respect a man willing to fight though so i buried him out back oh gosh and we stole his boots i hope benedict is right we can take over this town soon i'd love to get back to my wife Oh, there's a story about that guy. Um, but I won't spoil it. You guys can figure it all out. Now, there are secrets in this game, so it's worth sniffing around in all the nooks and crannies to make sure we're not missing anything. A couple of health potions there, but sometimes you find stuff behind the, uh, the paintings or cellars and that kind of thing. All right. Um, hmm. It's still nighttime. You know what? I'm going to just take a nap right here. Sleep till morning. Sleep till morning. There we go. It's now 8 a.m. All right, let's head back to town. Oh, I missed a chest. Oh, wow. Common Barbarian's Vest. Plus one armor, plus one toughness. All right, well, that's better than what Pauline is wearing right now. So let's take this off. Oops. Take that off and put that on. And I love it. Shows up in the world, or at least in her avatar here. Um, I don't think there's a third-person view or anything. So we can't really ever see Paulina in action, just in her little avatar. <laughs> okay, I'm going to head back. Hello, Jolene, looking good today. Everybody here packs heat, so you got to be careful. And we have Scott. Hi, Scott. How's it going? Just heading over to the blacksmith. Everybody stay calm. Here's the blacksmith shop. And there is a key to put your weapon down, but it doesn't work. For me anyway all right here's the blacksmith let's go ahead and give him his thing yes uh yeah we found your tools and he's going to give us something an orb of upgrade all right now that we're level two we can actually upgrade right here with this guy so how about if we upgrade our uh our new barbarian chest it's gonna cost a hundred and upgrade it to level two or we could maybe save that money let's not do that um, hold that thought. Let's go over to the wizard first. Because I know we can upgrade spells over here too. I think we can anyway. There's a wizard shop right here in town. And he offers teleportation services, which is kind of a fast travel. So, pretty nice place, right? With a tree right in the center. Uh, yeah, so this is the fast travel system. This is the whole map, which I'm pretty sure is all hand crafted. It's not procedural, but the loot... And the questing and all that, I think, is procedural. But I'm not entirely sure about that. But uh, that's a nice way to travel around quickly if necessary. And here's the Edge Wizard. Uh, what can you do for us? Well, you can upgrade an ability, potentially. Let's see if we can upgrade our Fire Spell. Yes, we can. Oh, oh yeah, I like it. So, so we can upgrade here as well as in our own talent tree. And it looks like... It's going to give us more damage up front and more damage over time. I think that's better than the uh, armor upgrade. All right. Did we get it? Yeah, we got it. Very good. Pleasure doing business with you. And now, um, oh, we can steal this stuff again. I've already been in here one time. It looks like the stuff comes back. Holy smokes. All right. Well, let's go down in his bedroom. I've been down here once already with Paulina. And, oh, yep. Yeah, stuff is back. Cool. We're going to rifle through it all again. <laughs> He's got a secret, uh, secret safe back here behind the um, behind the painting, and sure enough, it's all back again. Awesome. So yeah, these gems, I've been selling them because they're worth 
24 coins a piece but my guess is they're going to be used in some kind of crafting eventually but that's how i was able to buy the guns early on all right let's go do one more quest let's go get freddy four fingers i did fail with this quest one time before i started recording and i got killed by a very powerful wizard inside this cave I think it was level 3, but I, I bet we can get him now. Oh, gosh, they they uh, recruited more outlaws out front. But uh, I think we can handle these guys. Let's see how he's coming right at us. Yeah, get burned, dude. Get burned. He's going to burn very nicely. And here he comes. Goodbye. All right, I do love when they run straight at you. Much easier to hit. Now, this guy, is he a fire wizard? He's a fire wizard, so we're going to hit him with some ice. Well, I tried to hit him with some ice, but I missed. And I missed again. And I missed again. He does, they do dodge. Um, can't say that I appreciate it. <laughs> All right, let's heal up because I'm burning now. And I'm just going to shoot with my guns then. That's how it's going to be, buddy. Keep moving. I wonder if there's a time to shoot him. Yeah, I guess like that. Maybe when he's getting ready to do his thing. Fire wizards do not like. Oh, you better run. Oh, dang it. Don't like ice, do they? All right, we got him. Whew, okay. Let's go see what he dropped. Eh, some bullets and stuff. All right, we'll reload. We'll go get uh, Freddy Four Fingers. Oh, by the way, you can change the bullets in your weapon by holding down the R key. And if you have other bullets on your belt, which we do, you can switch them out. And this, uh, these green uncommon revolver bullets do 125% weapon damage. So, yeah, definitely worth switching, especially when you know you're going to get into a scrape. All right, we're in. We're in the cave, and it looks like everybody's back. So I'm going to go ahead and grab all the loots outside. Don't be shy with the bullets, because there's lots of shooting here. A couple of health potions right there. Let's go ahead and just zap this guy. These have really nice range, These uh, some of these spells, so it's worth it. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay. Burn, burn, baby, burn. That guy, I didn't see him over there. I'm going to lock on, even though it seems a little cheaty to me, but we're going to do it anyway. Oh, he's burning and reloading. I'm glad they get. They have to reload, too. <laughs> All right, let's switch weapon. This is reloaded, right? Where's that guy? Grab his loot. Uh, Did he run? Did he fall in the hole? It's a big hole. Oh, there he is. No. Nope. He's still there. Man, he dodged it again, didn't he? All right, we got him. Now, this rifle is not going to serve us well inside here. Let's switch to the repeater. And load it up. Oh, this uses uh, revolver ammo. Holy cow. Okay. And it's using up the good stuff, too. That's fine. It's going to do a little more damage. And we're going to need it against this guy coming up. Huh. I don't know if I can fall. But probably, and that's a long way down, so let's try to avoid that. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's the cave wizard. This is the guy. Now, I don't know if he's a fire wizard or what. Oh, he's a fire wizard. Yeah, uh, okay, we did the right thing. So zap him again with that cold stuff, and now I'm burning. Yeah, this is the guy that killed me last time. Let's see if we can take him out. It's going to be tough. But I think we got him. Heal up again. Heal up. There we go. And let's zap him with some ice. He hates that ice. All right, I think we got him, guys. I think we got him. Paulina's going to get her revenge right here. But I'm still burning. Oh, hi. <laughs> he came right around the corner. He's still alive? Okay, no, he's not. But I'm still burning. Paulina, drink a potion quick. Oh, gosh. All right, grab the loot quick. I think we might croak. Cave wizard's ring added. All right, that's worth the trip. Maybe he's got some more stuff over here. I'm still burning, man. That burn effect is nasty. High level wizard. There's the key. Edgetown cave key. Awesome. So that must open something here. I'm going to replace these bullets. And let's get rid of this guy. Just a regular old cave bandit. Should be easy to kill, right? Oh. Oh, gosh. I didn't see him. Uh, oh, that's Freddy Four Fingers. We found him. Oh, God. All right. I got to run. Got to run. <laughs> we found Freddy. Can we get Freddy? It's gonna be it's gonna be tough. Oh no. Out of mana. 
Maybe we can get Freddy. He's burning nicely right now. We might be able to do this. He's no wizard. He's just a regular old guy. So I think we might be able to get him. I'm going to switch to my repeater. Let's slow him down a little. Oh, he doesn't like the coal, does he? Need more mana and fry him. I think we got we got Freddy. We got Freddy four fingers. Now count his fingers because I'm curious if it was four on one hand or total. Wait a second. The dude's got ten fingers. What the? <laughs> the nickname means nothing. So we got bullets, bandages, apples, and Freddy four fingers scarf. Look at that, guys. And an orb of upgrade. Sweet. Let's check out that scarf. Oh, that's proof of Freddy Four Fingers' death, but I don't think we can wear it or anything. Yeah, that's a shame. All right. Well, I think I'm just going to head back now, turn in this quest. And, well, wait a second. Let's go down here and see if there's any awesome loot, first of all, because we did find a key, didn't we? There's got to be some loot. There it is, guys. I think that's the one. That must be the key to get in. Yep, unlocked with the edge cave key. Edge Town Cave Key. We got mana potions and a ruby. Ooh, how much is that ruby worth? I didn't happen to notice. 52. That's well, not great, but it's okay. All right, not too shabby. And a bunch more junk here. Bullets are always great. And, well, we got Freddy Four Fingers. And don't miss that. And now, oh, gosh, we can go collect our bounty. And that's going to be worth some money, too. Oh, look at all this. There's even more. This cave is huge. Oh, there's Benedict. But we are going to call it quits right here, folks. Been playing for quite some time now, and hopefully you have an idea of what the game is all about. And you can check it out in the Steam store page at link below. So, yeah, there we go. Once again, this is uh, Wild West uh, and Wizards. I think we got this guy, too. These, the non-wizards are pretty easy to kill, I think. Get roasted, Benedict. I think we got him. We got him. We got Benedict. And he's got Benedict's mining vest. Ooh, what is that all about? Plus two armor, plus two toughness, and plus one agility. Ooh, that's much better than what Pauline is wearing right now. Oh, yeah. All right. Styling and profiling now, baby. Still want a shotgun, though. Ooh, I just picked up a shotgun. Abigail's shotgun. I don't know. Oh, Abigail. Actually, I do know Abigail. She's in town. Let's uh, let's put the shotgun in. Can I put the shotgun? Oh, I can't use Abigail's shotgun? Level three. Oh, I can't use it because it's level three. All right. Well, we'll hold on to it till we get to level three. And now it's really time to quit. So have a nice day. See you next time. Bye-bye.